All right. Um, looks like the Nobel Peace Prize went to the World Food Program. The World Food Program. Um, I'm sure that the World Food Program did a good job. Because, and, and you know, they deserve the Peace Prize because when you think of feeding people, you think of peace. Do you? Or do you think that feeding people is just good by itself? Maybe feeding people should just stand alone. Maybe the Nobel Peace Prize should have something to do with peace. You know, I get it that feeding people helps keep the peace. I mean, I get it that they're connected. But in that way, isn't everything connected? I mean, you you know, electricity probably helps the peace too. Do you give the Nobel Peace Prize to electricity? So while I think the World Food Program probably did a great job, and I would like to congratulate them because I'm sure people looked into it and said, this is terrific. So no, no slight to them. Great work, people. I'm glad, I'm glad we have something called a World Food Program. That sounds like a really, really, really good thing. But they gave that prize to them just to fuck Trump, didn't they? <laughs> The Nobel Peace Prize just became a, a, well, I guess it's always been political, but it's so nakedly political when you've got uh, Trump. I mean, Trump so won the Nobel Peace Prize. I don't think even his critics would disagree that if you're narrowly looking at, you know, peace, it was Trump. (laughs) All right. I've never seen a cleaner example of somebody who won the prize and didn't win the prize. I mean, Trump won this times 10. There's nobody who, I don't think, name, seriously, in all seriousness, with no hyperbole, name one fucking person in the whole fucking world who deserved it more than Trump did this year. If you look at the Middle East, you look at, you know, uh, if you look at North Korea, you look at, uh, what, Serbia. I mean, it's not even close. He, he drew down the military and the, you know, I mean, it's not even close. There is nobody who's ever deserved a Nobel Peace Prize more than Trump. Nobody. It's not even close. Yeah, maybe Jared. You know, you can make an argument for Jared. Um, 